Hey everyone, welcome to another session from Bioschool. Actually, this session is a continuation part of ecological rules. Uh, so, in previous session, we have discussed about Watchman's rule and Allen's rule. I will drop the link in the description box down below. So, please make sure to go through those videos. And in today's session, we are going to discuss about competitive exclusion principle, which is also known as Gus's law. Okay, so what this principle states? You know in science each and every word matters okay so let's analyze the term competitive exclusion you know always the competition produce a winner right and the winner is someone who is better than uh, the other one all right it's a dominant is the strongest one right so similar thing right so what this law states competitive exclusion law it states that two species is competing for common resource cannot coexist let's say uh, there are two individuals they are fighting for the same resource same resource means same food material or same in environment to survive right so one of will definitely will be the dominant one and the other one is the weakest one right so what will happen the weakest one it cannot survive right the weakest one it cannot survive it may be eliminated from the competition or it, uh, or it can be evolved right or there is a way that it can evolve themselves in order to survive right so uh, like uh, the other one is excluded from the competition the weakest one is excluded from the competition right so this is actually the competitive exclusion principle is about if you want to learn in, in details about this principle with examples then definitely watch this video till then competitive exclusion principle this is also referred as Gauss's law okay Gauss's law and competitive exclusion principle is same thing what it states it states that two species competing for the same resources cannot coexist means they cannot live in the same place let's say in this example species a is the big fish and the species b is the smaller one okay and both the species they are competing for the same resources so what will happen the strongest one always in a competition there is always a dominant one and other one is the weakest one so those who is the dominant one or the strongest one will consume all the resources without leaving anything for the weaker one so what will happen the weaker one will either extinct extinct or it may evolve some new characteristics or may evolve some new characteristics in order to survive so always what will happen the weakest one will exclude it from the competition okay so this is all about the competitive exclusion principle so let's have a look on some more examples to get a better idea right so look at the, yeah look at this picture in picture number one the tree is covered by yellow colored words right the yellow colored words they search uh, the food across the whole tree so meanwhile what happened the red colored large birds they come into action Okay, and they start to compete for the same resources. Then what will happen? The red words, they dominate in the middle for the more abundant resources. Okay, here the red words, they are the dominant over the yellow one. The yellow ones are the weakest one and they cannot compete with the red colored large birds. So they exclude it from the competition and in order to survive or uh, they added to the new niche at the bottom and the top of the tree okay so that means uh, the two species those who are competing for the same resource they cannot be uh, exist they cannot be survive in the uh, same environment right they cannot be survive in the same environment so let's see one more example about paramecium so you can see in the uh, like graph A, in the graph A, 
this is about a paramecium aurelia one species of paramecium aurelia so when the paramecium aurelia is uh, growing alone this graph is uh, like a uh, growing upward like a uh, is is a uh, growing well similarly paramecium caudatum is also growing well alone but when the both species are grown together when they are mix up in the same environment or uh, they are providing with same amount of resource like the food and water then what happened look closely uh, the purple one is the paramecium caudatum initially paramecium caudatum is a uh, like a uh, is growing better way right it's a uh, is like is growing off but somehow the paramecium caudatum is not able to compete with paramecium aurelia and paramecium caudatum is excluded from the competition is excluded from the competition okay but if you will um, provide the different ecological factors then definitely paramecium caudatum will grow off so this means that if they are competing for the same resource same amount for the same food and the water okay if the two species they compete for the same resource they, then they cannot coexist in the same environment okay this is all about the competitive exclusion principle hope you like this video if you like this video then please do share it with your friends and subscribe my channel also give me your suggestion how can we will do it in a better way